What's popping? What's popping? What's popping, man? Y'all know what time it is. Hey, I'm about to uh, show y'all what, what we're getting with with these chains. You know what I mean? I'm gonna show y'all how to how to put the the picture on the chain. You see how the picture on the chain? I mean, how do we get y'all clear the picture? Up. But yeah. All right, I'm gonna show you how to do the picture though. So let me go ahead and delete this picture. I'm gonna go ahead, hit this, this. Then push my P, because I'm always pushing P, pushing P. Alright, then go to my object mode, open that, do this. So over here. Okay, you see, pull your chain out, whatever chain y'all got. Y'all y'all seen the first part. I'm assuming y'all seen the first part of the video. So I ain't gonna show y'all how to make the chain all over. You can just go watch part one. First thing we're gonna do is go ahead and make sure you got uh, Photoshop or something or something. You know what I mean? All right. It's like, or Photo P. Go to Photo P. You know what I mean? Photo P dot com. But I got Photoshop, so I'm gonna go ahead and go to the Photoshop. You go to my Discord. I got Photoshop free forever. It's only twenty dollars. One time. Ba ba ba. One time. And then you get all the other shit too. Mm -hmm. All right, let's get it. All right, we're gonna make our texture just like this. See, I got all them parts. So basically, what you're doing, you're gonna pull out one texture. I'm just gonna show you how long, how I made this texture. All right, but go ahead, pull out a texture. I'm about to make a whole new one. Pull out your textures. My textures right here. So I'm gonna go with um this one. I'm about to make a new texture real quick. I already got that one pre-made, as y'all see. But y'all just follow my lead. So put your main one right here, the main color you're gonna be hitting up, all that good stuff. Damn. Damn, fly. Shoe fly. Don't bother me. Alright, so go ahead, go back. To your textures, you see you got your textures right here. Make sure you got this window open. All right, then pick your next color. Oh, let me show you how to make texture colors too. So there's two videos in one. How to make texture colors. All right, so look, you see this right here. Hit this. You got all you need is one color. Then look, go to your hue. You can just adjust it. Hold on. Make sure you got your colorizer on. You can just adjust it, bitch. To every color you need your diamonds to be. You know what I mean? Turn it up some, make that bitch a little bit darker and all that good shit. And you can, you know what I mean? All the colors you need right here. So I like this color. I'm going to use this. Probably lighten it up a little bit. All right, so I'm going to use this as my base color. I like this color. All right, so that's how you make a color, right? Then once you don't, once you pick your color, you're gonna use click, click the Huey, then let hold your left shift, click the the one uh, random color you did, then right click, convert to smart, and bow. You got you a new color. You can delete this layer. All right. Now let's add some colors and all that good shit. So we're gonna go ahead and make us a little template. We put some black on there. Can't go wrong with the black on there. I like to put my shit in like little corners like this. Okay, see what I mean? You just add three, four other colors with some diamonds or whatever. You know what I mean? So go ahead, slide your shit on here, do what you do. I got a lot of my colors already made. So if you got a Huey on, you can do more than one color on. More than one color in one. This almost look like a color already got made. Which is my multicolor truth right here. <laughs> but it's cool. I'm just uh throwing some shit together to show you how it go. Alright, so pick some more colors. I'm gonna uh I'm gonna, I'm gonna show you how to add a diamond on there too. Might as well do that. So go ahead, push OK. Get this little button right here. Zoom in a little bit. And then we just gonna trace it out. Alright, 
So we'll do that and then hit this right here. You see you got that traced out. Zoom out. Got that little diamond. Hit this right here. You can move them around. Put them wherever you want them to go. So you usually want to put them somewhere you uh hold up. Somewhere you uh, um you usually have the what's it called? I'm thinking I'm in blender pushing the wrong buttons. But yeah. So I'll put it like right here in the middle sometimes, but I want it to be behind some diamonds so it can shine. You put it right here to the side a little bit, just like that. All right. So now we got our diamonds on there. We put one more color on there, just on some random. I'm gonna show you how to get a, a color out of shit. Oh, this is the Rich and Millie. So I'm gonna show you how to do the Rich and Millie. All right. So if you had a watch, the Rich and Millie VS that. You're just gonna do the same thing. Zoom in. Anything like that. Yeah. Putting putting behind some black diamonds usually because you got a black background. Oh shit, I'm thinking I'm on fucking Blender again, pushing the wrong buttons. Alright, so go ahead, throw him wherever you want him at. Make him a little bit smaller if you need to. Oh yeah, let go of your shit. You don't want to do that. Just make it smaller. Alright. Just like that. I'm trying to think if anything else I want on here. Matter of fact, it is. I want to put some diamonds on here too. Some real diamond diamonds. So when my shit starts shining and shit. Leave the diamonds on. Yeah. All right. So I'm gonna take these diamonds out. So once you do that, you can just move this over here, wherever you want to move them to. Let's move them to the left. Once you're done with that, pretty much done. We can go ahead and export it. PNG. Save it to your file. I'm just gonna call it Diamond Me. All right, so that's that's part one of that. How to do textures and shit. So if you just watch that part, I'm gonna cut this part of the video out. And, and get at and make another separate tutorial for that. So if you're watching the whole video, you you getting two things in one. So just keep watching, and we about to go back to Blender. If you is watching, or if you've been watching, but if you just tuned in for this the texture part, y'all know what to do. Like, comment, subscribe, all that good shit, man. Thank you for tuning in, man. Tap in with me. You know what it is. Uh, let's get it. But uh, let's go ahead, man. If you if you if you've been watching, man, and we talking about the pictures and shit, let's get this picture shit going. All right. So all right, back to the picture. At Mish, then I'm gonna add a cube. It's gonna come out big as shit. So zoom out. Then we're gonna go to scale and make it smaller. Make it thin. Right there, all right. And I'm gonna zoom out this way. I'm gonna make it smaller. Let's pick it up some. All right. Now we're gonna scale it some more. bit more. I don't want no big ass piece up there. Alright, so let's go ahead bring it bring it this way. To the left. Probably make it a little bit smaller. Alright, that's cool. So go ahead and push him down. And we're gonna go to push edit mode, hit your tab. 
And then we're going to bevel it. So control B. And then we're going to hit this bevel. Oh, shit. Hold up. Control C. Don't click off of it. All right. So tap and control B to bevel it. And then just zoom in a little bit. And then hit your control wheel. Scroll that up so the little sides could come in like that. And then just pull out a little bit and put it all right there. All right, then we got a little round off like that. And now it's back on there, just like that. Got a little smooth sides and shit. You know what I mean, it ain't just looking crazy. Let's see what. All right, so see we got the sides now, nice and clean. Now we're gonna go ahead turn this into a mesh f3 it mesh and then you should have you already you already know how to do all textures have your texture right there ready for it wow go down so your texture should have been added when y'all did your chain all right so when you did your chain you should already have the texture and everything already made out so you don't, even, you don't even have to go back. I just had to go back and show y'all how to make the texture. But anyways, let's go ahead and um, slide this over some. So I'm about to make sure it look cool. It ain't too far off. All right. And then we're going to hit our tab. Then A, U, project view. Tab, A, U, project view. All right. Just like that. All right, and if your shit come up like this, just do this right here. Sometimes they do that foo shit. Hold on, let's make sure everything on there. It's on there. Yeah, sometimes they do that foo shit. So go ahead and just hit this right here, and then you can go to your textures, whatever you had your texture as. All right, and then you'll be able to just pull it up. So go to your picture, whatever you had your picture as. Stretch him out right over the picture give it a little picture frame I'll be looking at my girl too long <laughs> I'm talking shit y'all good everybody gonna be looking I know my bitch bad alright let me go ahead and get this shit right here make sure it's lined up alright like that all right now you see how it's like straight up so let's give it a little bend a little bit so it don't look all crazy turn it back a little bit get that so we can go with the flow of the chain like that that's how you get the picture on there all right once you got your picture on there you already know what to do select all of it oh, hold up select all of it just like that make sure they all select it scroll down I got a lot on so I'm just control J it if anything missing I just add it to it but nope it's all on one now all right, so don't move it. Just click off of it and click on it. You see, you got all your parts. Looking good. All right, you just added it to the game. I'm going to show you how that look when it's in the game.